my sweets. Happy Wednesday. So today what we're going to do is we're going to go through our letter cards and then we'll get into our work. Say it with me. Ready? Set. Go. Letter L says wool. One more time. Letter L says wool. Like lion. Ready? Set. Go. Letter D says D. One more time. Letter D says D. Awesome. Here we go. Ready? Go. Letter S says S. Say it with me. Ready? Go. Letter S says S. Here we go. Ready? Go. Letter A says A. Ready? Go. Letter A says A. Like A apple. Ready? Set. Go. Letter G says G. One more time. Letter G says G. Ready, set, go. Letter O says ah. Ready, go. Letter O says ah. Last one, ready, set, go. Letter C says k. One more time. Letter C says k. Awesome. My sweets, today your learning target is to write lowercase l. So what I would like you to do is look up here, don't even take out your book yet. I'm gonna teach you how to write lowercase l, and I want you to look and watch first. Our learning target, like I said, is to write lowercase l, so you are going to learn how to do that. Lowercase l is super easy, but you have to be so careful. Lowercase l looks like the number one. So what you do is you pull straight down, strawberry to chocolate, stop. You pull straight down, Strawberry to chocolate. Stop. Oop, that one has a wiggle. I need to erase it. Pull straight down strawberry to chocolate. This is so easy. However, children make mistakes because they don't take their time. They go, oh, this is easy, and then they end up doing this. Watch. Uh-oh, that's not good. What did I do? I went under chocolate. Here my line's crooked and under chocolate, and I went under chocolate again. When you are making your lowercase l's, you need to be careful that you just go straight top to bottom. No curves. That one's a little curvy. It's hard for me to write from this side. No wiggles, and you stop at chocolate. All right, my loves, what you're going to do is you're going to take out your books, and you're going to open up to page 6. I want you to pause me, and I want you to fill out page six. Stay on those lines, and then make your own. I'm going to be taking a handwriting grade. Everybody in my class, all 19 of you, should get a perfect handwriting grade because all you're doing is making the letter one. But if you go under the lines, I can't give you a perfect grade. So please pause me, write your letter L's, and then we will have met our learning target for the day, writing lowercase l. Pause me now. All right, my loves, what we're going to do next is page 7. So you did your lowercase l's, and now we're going to do page 7. So you just have your pencil parked, nothing in your hand. Lily's going to talk about some of the things that she put in her dollhouse. If the picture... Ooh, we got to listen to the end. If it ends with the sound of... L, L, we're going to write lowercase L. If it doesn't, we're going to make an X. Pencils parked. Listen carefully. Here we go. Meet, Meet the, the Super, super kids. kids. Student, Student book. book. Unit, Unit 7, seven page, page 7. seven. Listen, Listen carefully and, and follow my directions. My directions. When, when you, you hear, hear this sound, your teacher will pause this recording so you have time to mark your answer. Hi, Lily. Hi, Alf. Hey, what's that big box you got there? This is a house for my Lion family. See? Doc helped me make it. Good idea. What are you going to put in the house? Don't the lions need chairs and tables and beds and stuff? Yes, they sure do. But look, my dad gave me this box of stuff from our basement. It's just, it's just a bunch, a bunch of little things, things he was going to throw away. away. I, thought I thought we could, could try, try to make, make furniture, furniture and maybe toys for the lines out of the junk, junk in this box. Okay, let's, let's see what he gave, gave you. you. Hmm, 
a couple of hairpins, a pin cushion, some buttons, an old key, a pipe cleaner, a scraggly toothbrush, a whistle, a mitten, and look! See this piece of shiny foil? Yes, I can see myself in it. Wouldn't this foil make a good mirror for the lions? Hmm, Dad Lion can check to see if his hat's on straight, and Lad and Max can make funny faces at themselves. We can tape the foil under the wall. It'll make a good mirror. Let's put it up now. Look at the mirror made of foil. Foil. Does foil end with the sound O? If your answer is yes, Write lowercase l on the lines next to the foil mirror. If your answer is no, mark an X on the lines. My turn first. Foil. Your turn. Foil. Do you hear L? L at the end of foil. Foil. Yeah, you do. So what you need to do is write a lowercase l. It's a straight line, strawberry straight down to chocolate. Write lowercase l by the foil mirror. Park your pencil. If you went under chocolate, erase it, please. All right, here we go. Pencil's parked. Now, now look, look at, at the, the bed, bed with, with the, the white, white sheets. sheets. The mirror, the mirror is, is fine, fine, but the, but the lines, lines need, need things, things like, like chairs, chairs and tables and beds, and beds too. too. I wonder I if there's, there's anything, anything here we could, we could use to make, to make a bed. bed. What, what about, about this raisin, raisin box? box? If, if we, we cut, cut off the, the front, front part, part like, like this, this and leave the, the sides, sides, it would, it would make, make a good, good bed. bed. Hey, hey yeah. yeah! The, the bed, bed made out of a raisin, raisin box looks very, very comfortable. comfortable. Box. Does box end with the sound O? If your answer is yes, Write lowercase l, l on the lines next to the raisin box bed. If, if your, your answer, answer is no, mark an X on the lines. lines. My turn first. Box. Your turn. Box. Does box end with L? L. Box. X. Nope, it ends with an X. So what you're going to do is put an X on the line because no, it does not start with or does not end with L. Oh, that's kind of a sloppy X. I want you to make a nicer X than Mrs. Barge did. It's hard to do it on the computer. When you're done, park your pencil. I parked mine. Here we go. Now, now look, look at the, the bed, bed with, with the, the red, red blanket. blanket. What if what it if gets, gets cold? cold? The line, the line would, would need, need some, some kind, kind of cover. cover. Like, like a, a blanket? blanket? Yes, we could use a tissue. Oh, a tissue is too thin. It wouldn't keep them warm. We need something thick and fluffy. Let's see if there's anything in the box that would work. How about this mitten? If we put this mitten in the box and then put the line inside the mitten, it'll be soft underneath and warm on the top. It's a very small mitten. I think it is perfect for Lulu, the doll. Yeah, Lulu would be cozy and warm in the mitten. Mitten. Does mitten end with the sound O? If your answer is yes, write lowercase l on the lines next to the bed with the red mitten blanket. If your answer is no, mark an X on the lines. My turn first. Mitten. Your turn. Mitten. Does mitten end with L? L. Mitten. No, it ends with the letter N. So we need to write an X on the line. It does not end with the sound of L. So you're going to write an X on the line. And then you're going to park your pencil. So you're not drawing anything else, playing with anything else. Park your pencil. Here we go. Now, now look, look at the, the jingle, jingle bell. bell. What's, What's that, that jingling? jingling? It's a, it's a little, little jingle, jingle bell. bell. See? It's so on the mitten. Well, well don't, don't you think we'd better, better take it off? Or else, or else every, every time, time Lulu rolls, rolls over and better, better anything, anything, she'll, she'll wake, wake up. up. 
Her blanket, blanket will have, have a built-in built alarm, alarm clock. clock. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's cut, cut it off. off. Now, now what should we do with this bell? bell? Well, it's, it's too, too big, big for any of the lions to wear. To wear. Besides, Besides, cats, cats wear, wear bells, bells around their necks. necks. But, but I, I never, never heard of the lions wearing bells. bells. <laughs> no. no. You know you what, what, though? The, the lions need a doorbell. Need a doorbell. If, if we, we tie, tie some string to the jingle bell and tape it next to the door, then visitors could ring the bell when they come to visit the lions. Let's try it. Here's some string. Tie it around, around the loop, the loop at, the at the top of the bell. Of the bell. Right. right. Now, now let's, let's tape the string, string next to the door. To the door. There. Anybody, Anybody home? home? <laughs> <laughs> the jingle bell makes a great doorbell for the lions. Bell. Does, Does bell end, end with, with the sound O? If, if your, your answer, answer is yes, yes Write lowercase lower l on the lines next to the jingle bell. bell. If your, if your answer, answer is no, mark an X, X on the lines. Okay, my turn first. Bell. Your turn. Bell. Do you hear l at the end of bell? Yes, you do. So pick up your pencil. You're going to write lowercase l. This also... Um, completes our learning target for today, writing lowercase l. So straight line, top to bottom. When you're done, park your pencil. We just met our learning target again for writing lowercase l, didn't we? I'm trying to bring it down so you can see that too. All right, park your pencil, two left, here we go. Great job listening. Now, now look, look at, at the, the wooden, wooden spool with, with the, the twisted, twisted wire. wire. Hey, look at this wooden spool. All the threads off it. I bet we could use this to make something for the lions. A table? No, it's too small for a table. A chair? No, it has that hole in the middle. It would be uncomfortable to sit on. What if, what if we put it on its side so it rolls? And then put a pipe cleaner through the holes, like this. Then twist the ends together. See what I've made? A carpet sweeper? No, no, it's, it's supposed, supposed to be a lawnmower. Oh, sure. I get it. It's a lawnmower, all right. <laughs> this fool does make kind of a weird lawnmower, but I think the lions will like it anyway. Spool. Does spool end with the sound O? If your answer is yes, write lowercase l on the lines next to the spool. If your answer is no, mark an x on the lines. My turn first. Spool. Your turn. Spool. Now this spool had the thread all come off of it. Does spool end with the sound of L? Yes, it does. So you are going to pick up your pencil and you are going to write lowercase L. They're pretending that's the lawnmower, right? All right. You are writing lowercase L. Top to bottom, not going under chocolate, not going above strawberry. Park your pencil, one left. Now, now look, look at, at the, the two wooden, wooden chopsticks. chopsticks. What, what are, are these, these wooden, wooden sticks? sticks? Those, Those are, are chopsticks. chopsticks. Many, Many people, people who live in China, China or Japan, Japan use, use them, them to eat with. with. My, My mother, mother taught, taught me to eat with, with these chopsticks. chopsticks. See? You hold, hold them like, like this, this, both in one hand. hand. Can, Can I, I try? Sure. Hold one steady. And, and hold, hold the, the other sort of, sort of the way you hold a pencil. pencil. Oops. <laughs> That's a little <laughs> tricky at first. Maybe, Maybe we, we can use the chopsticks to make something for the lions. That's a good idea. Let's, Let's see. To, to us, the chopsticks are thin, thin the size of pencils. pencils. But, but to, to the, the lions, lions they are tall poles. Like stilts. That's it. Let's use the chopsticks to make Lass and Lad a pair of stilts to walk with. We can, we can make, make a, a little, little notch, notch on each chopstick with scissors like this. Now, now they have, have a place to put their feet. Lass and, and Lad can have lots of fun playing with their chopstick stilts. Chopsticks. Does chopsticks end with the sound O? If your answer is yes, write lowercase l on the lines next to the chopsticks. If your answer is no, Mark an X on the lines. My turn first. 
Chopsticks. Your turn. Chopsticks. Does chopsticks end with the sound l? Chopsticks. No one ends with s. So you need to take your pencil and write an x on the lines. Park your pencil when you're done. Let's, Let's check, check your, your answers. answers. Oh, we're not going to do that. All right, my sweets. What you were going to do is ask your grown-up to upload a picture of page 6 and page 7 to the red reading folder. You did great today for reading, my sweets. Make sure you read two rows to your um, parent tonight, okay? Um, reading has been short the last few days, so you can read two rows, okay? Do your best. I love you and I'm proud of you. Bye. Keep up the good work.